This year, we saw air let out of the balloon, evaporation of trust across all institutions. That's a first. Today we uh, introduced the uh, 15th uh, Edelman Trust Barometer in Davos. Um, the uh, key finding actually was that uh, the pace of innovation uh, is actually a trust detractor. And uh, that was fairly surprising. Um, and um, also that the uh, reputation of the tech industry actually went backwards. It's always been the uh, most positive. And uh, there was a lot of discussion about this year being the time when the tech industry has to step up. Um, and uh, actually cooperate with government instead of pushing it away. If tech companies do not engage and come out of, frankly, our bubble and say to governments, we must partner on this, either governments will try to govern the internet much more strongly, right. or countries will start fragmenting the internet. That uh, vision we have of one internet that brings us together is at stake right now. If we do not move responsibly to create uh, frankly, the trust. How can we find uh, some common ground or middle ground so that what's happening in the, in the tech world, innovation, does not have an adverse impact on trust in government? For me, a major dimension here is to try to um, re-inject the ability to actually have an impact at scale uh, at a time where actually uh, we are looking at fermentation and the control. And, and, uh, and I think this is, uh, this is a major issue for us in facing global environmental challenges. Right. Is this going to continue, this decline of trust in technology, do you think? Yes, the honeymoon is over for technology. People are paying attention to how technology companies are actually playing in their lives, in their economies. The robber baron mentality is starting to set in. Somebody's making $132 billion personally to, to eliminate half a million jobs with their, tech, with their technology. And people are starting to connect those dots. You don't get trust by uh, what you say. You've got to get trust by what you do. Bring on board people who understand public policy. There's a change in culture that needs to happen beyond the technology issue. Right. that I hope happens this year. 2015 is definitely going to be a year um, in which uh, innovation um, is going to have to be turned to a positive for uh, business. Um, and that's going to mean that you have to explain the how and the why, not just the what.